Hi, welcome to Cardstock Modeling. My name's Sam Miller. I've been off the uh, YouTube scene in terms of creating new content for a few months. The sole purpose is, is uh, liquidating assets from a 15 year stint in video productions and repurposing those funds into upgrading the cameras for this studio so we can do more things with uh, cardstock modeling, better quality, improved graphic looks, all that kind of good stuff. Now, let's take a short tour of the different tools I have to use to guide you through the craft. To my right, we have a second camera, it's a little bit wider lens, gives you a, a feel for my studio, the models in the background, uh, some of the things I've created, which I will, I have and will allude to in future episodes. Uh, next thing we have to offer is an on-screen shot where I can uh, have, uh, have you take a look at some things I've created in Photoshop or some of the pages of a particular project itself. And in this case, um, on the left-hand side, this is a kitchen, and it's a shadow box that I modified that originally came with a Clever Brothers kit, but it wasn't a kitchen, and it was in a bookstore. And so I repositioned uh, this to the back of the, ha of the structure so you could get a look inside the kitchen for a place I've created called uh, Mom's Diner. And what I did is I found things online to add the effect of a stove and a sink and a refrigerator and hope to be able to have a, a little floor space to put some freestanding items that are three-dimensional. Another feature what I've added with new studio is now that we have the on-camera that I can look to you and also illustrate something that uh, whether it's on screen or even in the cutting mode, which I'm about to show you right now. So now you'll be able to see me with more detailed cuts. We can even magnify greater than this. Plus it also has the picture and picture feature that I can talk directly to you while I'm trying to illustrate some stuff with my hand. So that's about the extent of things. Again, uh, when I started the first one or two of these back in April, of 2020 coming out of uh, the COVID or experiencing like you are and were the COVID blues and had more time in my hands. And I thought, well, how can I take uh, my skill sets of video production and some recently learned in the last year or two prior to that, uh, doing some cardstock modeling for my grandson's interest in railroads or model railroads to share with the rest of you. I would never believed we would be at like 750, 800 subscribers today. And with views hitting the 25,000 range just on eight videos. So my uh, uh, thoughts going forward in this, and it's with the enthusiasm from the feedback that you've given me, is to do more things like this. And we can do modifications. Let's say we have live Facebook events. We can even do live YouTube events. We can do live real-time Zoom events. And we could sort of have this, uh, in the, like the old days, a quilting bee, but this could be a cardstock bee where you brought your project, talked about it, um, chatted. Uh, the, the whole part of this is sharing and fellowship, you know, experiencing it, not only talking about cardstocking, but maybe what's going on in your life. So, Till the next episode in the main event, and please leave comments of the, the directions you think we should take this, because it's a we, not a me. Again, have fun, and by all means, keep your cuts straight, except when you're going around a circle. See you soon. Thanks.